All right. I've not seen Hello, everyone. Like so yeah, this is going to be my new character, I think. It's going to be an impending doom. It will be leveling up as a uh, poisoned concoction. But yeah, so, so here we go. I'll try and keep this as down to earth as possible without using tons of units and stuff like that for the quick leveling. Give kind of like more like a general feeling for how I find the leveling process. I'm not the best player at all and I am not the fastest either. So yeah, I'm going to take my time and just going to enjoy it, see how it goes. If you saw my other playthrough with the Righteous Fire Inquisitor, you will probably have a good idea of what is coming up. But yeah, I'll just slowly... Let me see if I can't get this to work. Yeah, I think we will start out with Caustic Arrow as soon as I get one. It should be moments out. Fine work. And there it is. It's it's one of my favorites. Oh, beginner spells as well. I really, really like playing with that. Passive. Can I have a equal to like a goldfish? I forget everything as well. And there's the first, I know, well, first of many where I cannot find my way around anything. I can literally get lost in a roundabout, so <laughs> bear with me. Yeah, I've been really looking forward to giving this build a shot, because what I understand is they are nerfing Spell Cascade the next season, which will literally cause Impending Doom to be quite nerfed out. So this is probably one of the last seasons where we can like play Impending Doom at its current uh, strengths. We'll see how it goes. And I'm an incredibly impatient person, so hopefully I'll feel Build the power quickly. I think I will. I have a good idea in my head on how this is going to go. We'll see. So yes, just going to move into the Tidal Island to get the medicine chest for a quicksilver, um, a quicksilver potion, so we can run a little bit faster. It's a general good thing to do every time you start a new character. Very, very nice. Beats things up quite a bit, and also I find movement speed to be one of the best defensive things in the game. Super nice as kiting. to keep an eye on or any potential good links i'd like to get like a ripple green i think as fast as possible for our poison concoction setup up 
which I believe we can switch into a level 12. Oh, did I? Oh, that's how it You would see him there. So much damage. You should drop the teleport as well, so good to get back home. But there is another trick you can do. Um, is you can literally go to your character selection screen and double click again and you'll actually spawn in town. And since you picked up the waypoint, you can port directly to waypoint. Which is very nice. However, on League starts, that can be a bit tricky to do, mainly because, you know, the servers are a bit unstable due to the traffic and stuff like that. Yeah, it's a bit of a gamble when it comes to that. Yeah. Yes. A bit of stuff here. Let's see. Ah, there's a lot of stats there. Oh. Also, another good thing is to always check for movement speed boots. Oh, as I just said, movement speed is just such a nice thing to get a little bit of more. Speedy, speedy going, and for survival in general. Yeah, no, you know, out of luck this time, but it's all right. No three green links. Too bad. Oh, we do actually have three greens. That's amazing. Awesome. Very happy about that. That also mean we should upgrade our... Yes. We can already put in a Mirage Arrow. Very soon. So that's, well, still alive. that's gonna be so That's not bad from for the first boss act. But yeah, let's just continue and see what happens. So I will be recording about an act at a time. In the beginning I'll probably upload about twice a day, maybe three times depending on how I Get things going. Yeah, we'll see. Didn't see this early league start, and I don't have much to do, so <laughs> I have lots of time for recording at the moment. Uh, these guys can be quite bothersome, and if they gang up on you, you can get screwed very quickly. So, uh, yeah. Ooh, go hide, that might actually be something. Let's hope for some movement. Arrow quiver more. Uh, yeah, I well, we already did. Need a identification. They call them in Diablo. A lot of wisdom. Too bad. See that one. Next time. Yeah. I am also live on Twitch most days, so yeah, pop over there and have a have a look. Follow me live if you want. Oh, that one. Up. Get off me. Get indeed. Off we go. You'll probably see me skipping quite a lot of monsters. It's mainly because I keep an eye on the monster level count. If you're like five above or five below, you're in a good range. Yeah. Don't really need to kill everything in this. I think that. Oh, it's not. See, there we go. I'm already doing it wrong. Of course, I want my attack speed. Yeah. Makes sense. Alright. One portal scroll. Alright.
So yeah, I'm currently following Tai Tai. No, it's not. Yeah, it's Tai Tai Killer's uh, leveling guide. However, it's crouching to his uh, Pathfinder impending doom guide I'm following. Yeah. You can find that on Max Roll. Um, you are interested. So I'm just going to pop a portal here because we're actually going to run for the ledge. If you get to this bridge, you'll know that if you cross it, you will get to the ledge. And you will know that the cave or the plus one skill where you kill the big crap is on the other side. Yeah. So once we get to the waypoint at the ledge, if I don't die now, um, we will we will head back here to clear up that skill quest. Here we are. But this is quite a nice place to get a bit of XP before you go down and kill the crab. Back in the days, we used this to like grind before we like went up in difficulty level. Before then, we had like, was it like cruel, merciless, normal, I think. Three difficulties. It was, it was interesting. That's poison. Rustic Sash. Physical damage. It's alright. Silver coin. Ooh. I will not be doing the current lead mechanic throughout the leveling. That's something I'll save for the later, uh, later end game. I do also have a couple of people uh, to play with to get to that. So that's probably going to be a very interesting thing. I'll definitely be streaming that as well. But yeah, I'm just going to head back to town really quickly to see if I can get my Mirage arrow. I can't remember if it's now or after the quest. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, what do we got? Bear trap. Hyper smack, we need that. Hyper smack. Eyes, ooh, dash. Stay sharp out there. I like to have it on the space key. So, yes? Mirage arrow, can we get? Mirage. We can indeed. Super nice. Well, we we well, back to the beast. The Mirage is super nice for leveling as well. Like you basically can just run while it shoots for you and kill things around you. It's very useful when playing it like an early bow build. I'm not up to that just yet. Up here? Yeah, I think. Oh, gonna go around. Put you down here. Price. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Again, I don't really know the presets or the layouts or anything. Yeah, bear with me. <laughs> never, never gotten around to bigger levels out than I have played in the campaign so many times now. But I still forget things. That's 
Oh, that might... Oh, well, we are gonna change into poisonous concoction soon-ish, so... Doesn't matter too much. We just need to get ourselves some decent healing pots before that, and that would be nice. Did I run the, I run the wrong way again? Yes, of course I did. But yeah, this is gonna be happening a lot, and I apologize. I am really not good at figuring out the way. I should really look these kind of presets on. Save me like hours, hours of playtime. So. And here he is, the guy. Oh yeah. Always a joy. Did I forget a potion? Uh, it's a teleport. Get it. Ah, well, we're just gonna do the plug in and out then. So many items. Um, nothing I find totally useful right now. I don't think I have a portal scroll. Oh well. Exit to character scroll. Wanna go grab our first skill point here. Quest skill point, that is. Um, thank you. Here we go. North. Yeah. You like those fast chat. One of the most cooler things about this Pathfinder is once your defenses like kicks in, you're gonna be have like permanent flasks uptime, which is just a massive, massive defensive capability. I'm really looking forward to trying that because I never really managed to get to that point. Yet. But, uh, yep, that's gonna happen now. I'm sure of it. And we got some fire resistance. Not bad at all. Ancient attack. Accuracy fading, buddy. Oh, that. 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 Yeah, as I've said, I, I'm gonna try to keep it as early game like as possible i do have quite a bit of currency and stuff already saved up but i don't kind of want to use it for the leveling process mainly because i want to give people a good idea about how it feels to level up the character from the start and from a bit more casual kind of playstyle. I forgot the bait. We're fine. Don't need it. Uh, we'll just head into the prison, and in the prison there will be a trial. It's very important to pick up for your sentences. However, I have already done it once uh, this league, so I won't have to do it. The first trial is here in the lower prison. And that is incredibly important that you pick that up. Let's grab the Fast charges.
There's a patty in there. So if I won't run into the trial, just remember to pick it up. You won't miss it. It is very important. So I don't think I'll run into it by now. Need some new potions. Yeah, something. I kind of want to show you guys how it looks like. Just um, I mean, both of you have a good idea what. So here it is. This is this is a trial of ascendancy. There is six of them you'll have to go through uh, in the first three acts, and then you'll have to do another three in in acts. I think it's uh, five, six, and seven, -ish. and then three more in eight, nine, and ten. So you will do in uh, a total of three ascendancy trials throughout the acts. And these are exceptionally important for your overall progression of your character. And gives you a massive amount of power as well. So yeah, once we've collected the first six... Oh yeah, okay, there we go. First death, there we go. First of men. That's fine. It's me playing stupid. Ay, 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 these are lightning... Unless they don't like me. Okay. There we go. Okay, so here we go. You press this and bam, there you go. You've completed it and the portal will spawn. And you are done with the first round. As you can see, you will have to collect all six. I'll show you. Let's fill that. Okay, so you collect all six trials. And then you can enter the labyrinth. But yeah, because I have already done it once throughout this uh, this league, it will continue. Um, I, I would not have to do this again. But yeah, that's nice. At least now you know. So when I say you have a trial in this area, you need to look for that kind of area. Coming up for our first mini boss, as call him. It's always a joy to play against. Let's see if I can actually survive. I cannot find my way around anywhere. I'm not up to that just yet. Getting close. Yeah, there we are. 
All righty. Now, I'll most likely die again. I wouldn't be surprised. Quite sure of yourself, aren't you, Hunter? Hello, pity. The warden enjoys the taste of overconfidence. He's our good friend, Mr. Brutus. He's mean and hits very hard. Oh my goodness, my damage is abysmal. Hopefully that will be better very soon. Oh. I will soon change some damage of Bellison. Should probably have taken Burning Arrow or something like that for single target. My mouse all over the place right now. Moody today, it looks like. Yeah, he is very moody. Cheese. Oh well. Oh, that's two. Ah, I think. Uh, I think the RF was a bit on the slow side for me. I want a bit faster build, so impending doom it is. You know how I am, I re-roll about 15 times before I find anything I find interesting anyways. <laughs> oh, hello. Alright, oh, which arc build was it again? Can't remember. Oh, the one you showed me, right? God. Hey, a medium life last. That's good. That's very good. Uh, let's see if there's something useful about it. Even though I'm not going to use that because of the free link. Hacking crystal bag. Such a lovely button. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. It's like big explosion, right? Did you manage to get into your red maps then? Oh, no. <laughs> there you go, man. That's awesome. That sounds really good, actually. Ah, oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. That's good to hear. It, it's nice when you finally find uh, one of those builds where you just feel like everything just clicks. It's been a while since I felt that way. 
Well, I did manage to get my Righteous Fire going a couple of leagues back, but yeah, I played it way too much. Bit of an overestimation. To do another run with that. Hello. I want another life. Well, these three. Yes. Wait, that's. Not have another life. Yes. Be well. Ah, very nice. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's nice. Yeah, Legion is very profitable as well, isn't it? That's just awesome. I might just buy. Never mind. All right. Um, quickly look. Built. Bastard. Good used. Let's move. Like. No double green link. Ponies. Stay sharp. Never mind. Go. Standing still way too long. But yeah, the movement speed is quite nice. So I'm gonna do uh, Crouching Tuna's version, the, the the Pathfinder version, which is basically you know 100% uh, uptime on 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 potions. Basically, just can tank everything, but like yeah, big smash attacks. There is the Oculus as well, but it's probably more damage heavy, but the defensive I doubt is as strong. The whole thing about being able to have your healing potion running like 24-7, it's just insane. The amount of regen you get is massive. Yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to that. Oh. Actually, gonna swap now as soon as we said. Oh, oh.
heading down here so we can get a skill point. Well, it's a quest item for a skill point. Jesus Christ, the damn really low on caustic arrows now. Is that poisoning? Oh, we actually got it. There we go. It's not half the strength. Those stats we most likely will be short on later on. That thing is robust. I almost feel like I have to kill it. Gonna go see if I can quickly to level set. Actually, we just. <sighs> Extra life. I should really have gone into burning out on this. I'm gonna grab this waypoint. Pop back to town really quickly and let's see if we. Oh my god, it's the wrong button. If we can get our poisons concoction on. There it is. Farewell. Fantastic. Pop that in there. Combine Bonnie. Wait, man. Hello. It's a volley. Wait, man. There we go. Got a large potion as well, which is absolutely awesome. 
So it's recommended to have about three with potions Goodbye. running. Because poison concoction will be using your life potion. You cannot use Yeah, they're not. Welcome. Same. That's gonna be not that. Sniper's uh, mine. And of course, we want our dash. I need to find a greeting. Bed. That must be. Dash. Check out for later. He's now. I am sure. Yeah, there it is. Oh. Roll resistance for the next boss is quite nice. Sharp That's going to be an improvement. Just going to quickly Farewell. check for potions as well. Also. Mm -hmm. That's a great alive. What's that? I'm going to grab that. Alright, let's get going. So hopefully we should see quite a big increase in damage now. Massive. Massive diff. Feels so much better. That's awesome. So yeah, we are almost finished with that one. So that's very nice. And here comes the egg boss. Such a better damage, it's incredible. I do, however, know that it's probably not going to scale too far up. It's going to be okay throughout the campaign, but it will drop off. They nerfed Poison Concoction quite a bit. A couple of leads back. It's one of my uh, better half's favorite builds, and every time she plays something she likes, it's they're basically getting nerfed. So. But yeah, that's the first act basically. So we're heading into act two. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna stop it here and uh, thank you for watching. Stay tuned. And if you have any questions, please.
don't hesitate to yeah to write a comment or anything. I will get back to you as fast as I can. Alright. Bye bye.